Hey guys, in today's lesson, we are going to learn the programming action group. Here, I will take creating an action group consisting of ten actions to allow the spider pipe to wave X example to show you guys how to add in the action group. Firstly, open spider pipe PC software. After starting, program spider pipe to stand in the low stance. Click open action group file button and find stand low file. Click open. Now, we see the first action data in action group list. Click the black triangle to execute and update the action value to the server control area. Step 2. We are going to program the second action. Program spider pipe to write the right number 1 leg. Therefore, we need to address the ID17 and ID18 servo when dragging the slider. Pay attention to the spider's data. Please adjust according to the servo data and click the Add Action button to add the action data. Do not forget to add each single action into the list. Step 3. For the better performance, set number 3 action as the preparation. Modify the time to 200 milliseconds and add step 2 again. Step 4. Modify the time back to 500 milliseconds. Advise ID16 servo to wave the right leg. Step 5. The fifth action is to rotate the wrist right leg to left. We need to address the ID16 servo again. Step 6. Program the wrist leg to turn as the number 6 action. Just copy the previous action, move the mouse to the fourth action, then click to execute and update the action value. Click Add Action again. Now, we add the new action that is similar to number 4 action. Step 7. Number 7 action will let the right leg rotate to the left. A method of step 6 can be taken to copy the number 5 action. Step A. Number 8 action moves back to the stator when the right leg is just raised. That is copy number 2 action. Step 9. Number 9 action we use to transition. Modify the time to 200 milliseconds. The last action allows the robot to return a low posture. You just need to copy the number 1 action. Ok, the grading action group has been programmed successfully. Now, run the action group. If you want to modify one of the action, you can execute the action to update the action value to the servo control area. Then you can drag the slider to modify the value and update action. You can modify the corresponding value in action group list as well. For example, I want to raise the right number 1 like higher. Now, we need to run number 2 action and drag the slider of ID17 servo. Then remember to update action. Since the height of the raised leg is the same for the action number 2 to number 9, we only need to modify the ID17 servo value of ID17 servo from number 2 action to number 9 action to the same value directly. After modifying, execute the action group again. After programming, please save the action group for future debugging. Click Save Action File, choose the corresponding path, name it such as Great, and then click Save button. Okay, this is the end of the video. Please have a try.